In today's video, I'm going to show you a quick play that's going to help you beat the meta man-to-man -man coverage you're probably facing in Madden NFL 21. What's up, guys? My name is Cody, and I want to welcome you to my YouTube channel. If you've never had the opportunity to check out one of my videos, I just want to thank you for taking the time to check this video out. And I really hope, and my goal here at my YouTube channel is to help you become a better Madden player. And so um, if you're looking to get better at the game, I would invite you to go ahead and click that subscribe button at the bottom right-hand corner of your screen because I upload four videos a day that are designed, like I said, to give you some type of tactic tip or strategy or concept that will help you to kind of get better in some way shape or form okay uh, we also live stream every single night at 10 o'clock p.m eastern time on youtube twitch and facebook links are in the description to those but i would love for you guys to come by and check out one of those streams all right guys let's jump right in here so we're in the spread playbook, and the formation that I'm going to look at is PA, the play P.A. Reed from the gun tight slot open. This play is actually very underrated in my opinion, um, but basically this does a really, really good job at beating pretty much every coverage in the game. You can turn it into uh, multiple other beaters, but we're going to show you specifically cover two man. And with this, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to um, – this is primarily if they run something like this, right? If they run something like this where they're going to use or their, their middle linebacker and they're going to throw the safeties and purples at 20 yards to try to stop crossing routes. All you're going to do is you're going to take Willie Sneed here and you're going to put him on a, um, a slant route. And then I like to take Boykin and just put him on, you know, really anything. Um, you see, it's kind of a hidden little formation. I like smoke screen. Uh, you could also zig him. You could curl him. You could do pretty much anything you want with him. Or one thing you could do is you could slant Boykin. But I personally like the motion slant to Willie Sneed here. Uh, but basically what you're going to see here is this post route to the left side is, uh, is going to get wide open. Um, and so all we're going to do is snap the ball. And what you'll see here, this post route to Mar Marquise Brown is going to absolutely cook the man-to-man -man coverage over the top of the of the defense very very easily. Now, if you have a if you have a route technician or you have someone that has maybe slot o matic you know those are all factors that are going to play into this. But what I do want you to know is you can very very effectively uh, just kind of work this little play right up the field. Now, one thing you can also do if you want to if you really want to burn um, the coverage is you can take Sneed and you can put him on a streak, motion him over. This is just going to help a little bit in case you see here. See how they got if they have the the deep safeties this post route's not as much of an option one thing you can do though like even if they have the deep safeties if you pass lead it up you can almost kind of get it there that time we weren't able to do that one thing i do like to do which i haven't talked about this a lot actually is taking this receiver right here boykin if you motion him let me see if i can get him over yep you can motion him all the way over to the left you see how he's on this angled streak if you motion while he if you motion or snap it while he's in motion um he's actually going to be kind of good for you if they take the again this is all if they take the safeties away but if they don't take the safeties away take the underneath crossing routes right you're going to have multiple underneath crossing routes like this one to the tight end right here mark andrews if they don't take the safeties away you hit the crossers but effectively all we're going to do you know, and, and you can leave Boykin here. You can kind of do whatever you want with him. If you want him on the streak, I would recommend uh, kind of motion him, motioning him over. And what you'll see here, you know, is if they take the safeties away, you can actually, you know, have two reads that will typically be really, really well for you. Um, Lamar, for whatever reason, because of his throw power, he's not going to be able to make this throw as good um, or make it as effective as it could be. I need to probably bullet it. But let me show you really quickly here. And again, this is primarily man-to-man -man defense. We're not really looking at zone right now. Uh, I'll show you. I'll show you what this does against zone here in just a minute. You just want him in motion when you snap him. And then you'll see um, how they kind of work off of one another. And Marquise Brown is able to burn man-to-man -man coverage over the top. That's shaded over the top man-to-man -to -man coverage, by the way. It's shaded outside and shaded over the top. Um, so that's kind of the meta defense that you'll see. Now, real quick, guys, if you really want to take your Madden game to the next level, one of the things I did want to highlight for you is my texting membership. I started this uh, about a week or two ago, I think two weeks ago. And basically what I, what I do is every single week, I send out an exclusive tip that I don't release on YouTube, don't release really anywhere else to just my text message members, people who have uh, essentially texted me, either asked a question or had a Madden conversation with me. My number is in the top left corner of every video that I do so that you can easily access that. 
but I would love to connect with you via text if we have not already connected that way. And again, it's very, very straightforward and very, very simple to do. Literally, that's my personal cell phone number. All you do is pull your phone out right now, text your name, or just say what's up to um, 812-216-3644. Again, 100% you know, my real personal phone number is that number. Okay. So I've actually talked to some of you guys on the phone before. So, um, anyways, that is, you know, I did want to highlight that and that's a great, great, great opportunity for you. If you haven't already, you know, experienced what we can do with that. Um, to me, that is one really, really effective way. Like I said, every single week we send out a tip. This last tip that we did, um, this last tip that we did for it was uh, 50 minutes long of breakdowns on how to stop the run. We show you how to stop the run from every single, every single uh, way that they can run the ball. We show you how to stop it. Literally every single way um, that is possible for someone to run the ball, uh, at least at least for the most part. So uh, over 50 minutes of breakdowns on that for you. Um, we have a ton of resources for you at this channel. Uh, I also have a Discord if you haven't already jumped into that. But this this route combination, you know, I think really works well. These, you know slant in combination with crossing routes this year does a really really good job this is you if you'll notice if they run like cover four what you'll see is uh for the most part you'll see this this will actually should burn cover four over the top let me see if i can get it and yeah if lamar can make it if, if lamar can make the throw a little bit better this would work easily this would burn cover four over the top um you know, but but primarily I use this as a man beater. Uh, like I said, I do oftentimes motion uh, Boykin over, just like this, kind of create a little compressed bunch type of feel here. Um, just pass that to the right, click on, and you see you can typically, you know, like I said, if you if you if you're on the left hash, you know, that's another thing. You know, you would want to be on the left hash for this, so it's going to give you a little bit more space. You know, there's some things that you can do to kind of make this beat cover four and make it beat cover three, but primarily, guys, I just wanted to show you how this beats man to man, and specifically the meta man to man defense, and just kind of creates a unique, I think, a very very unique set of crossing routes. Um, you see a lot of people using the the PA post shot from uh, Tennessee or whatever. This is a kind of a version of that that you can utilize. It's not as good, but it's still effective. Um, and what's really cool about this formation is what you'll notice is there's a lot of things you can do. You've got a nice compressed T route. You could take Brown. You can motion him over. I mean, there's just so many things that you could do to get creative with this. Um, but this is a fairly solid formation for beating man-to-man, -man, fairly solid formation in Madden 21 in general. So be sure to check that out. It's in the gun spread. I do want to invite you guys to join the Discord. There's a link to that in the description of today's video. And I also want to let you know that we will be live streaming tonight at 10 o'clock, and I'd love for you to come by and check it out. But be sure to text in. You don't want to miss that tip. Again, those tips that I release for you text, they're not going on my YouTube channel. They're not going to my Discord. They're only for people who text me um, and, and ask to get those videos. So if you want to get those, be sure to text me. And also, if you just have general Madden questions that you need answered, if you want an answer from me, text me. If you want an answer from my community, ask it in the Discord. And those are some really, really solid and effective ways to get better at this game. So I want to thank you for watching. And I want to encourage you that we will have a couple more videos coming today on our YouTube channel as well as our nightly live stream.